Hey guys, Joe DeMarco from the Crazy New York Driver Show. Today is Wednesday, March 23rd, 2016. And today I decided to give you guys a little look at my hubcap collection, and I hope you guys find it interesting. As many of you know, I own a store called Hubcap Joe's in Oradell, New Jersey, and I sell a lot of my hubcaps on eBay. But let's just take a little look today at some of the hubcaps themselves, because a lot of you guys have been asking to see them. Here you can see a wall of brand new Toyota hubcaps, which, of course, are all made of plastic. These are little center caps that go in the middle of various Ford truck models. These are very popular because Ford makes so many different wheel and tire packages per model year per truck. Here you can see a stack of some hubcaps. Certain hubcaps will stack very nicely. Some others won't. Therefore I made racks and you'll see more racks later on in the video because sometimes racks are the best way to stack your hubcaps and keep them organized. Here you can see these mostly plastic hubcaps stack very well. Again, more plastic hubcaps. These are dog dish hubcaps, the kind that fit just in the center of the wheel, like some of your work fans will use. These are more center caps. These are what I call little plugs. These go in the middle of alloy wheels, and these are a real nuisance to deal with, let me tell you. This is probably my most unusual hubcap a really old Rolls-Royce hubcap. I myself don't even know what year it's from. I'm gonna guess it's at least from the 50s but maybe even older than that. I have never actually seen this on a car per se but I know it's one of those big old-fashioned slope back Rolls-Royces. This thing weighs a ton and notice the unusual way that it clips to the hub of the wheel. This happens to be my hubcap on my own personal car, a very plain, nondescript Chevy hubcap. And of course, like everything else today, it's plastic. This happens to be a Volkswagen. These are just some assorted center caps I decided to take out and show you for the video. This is what's called a trim ring. This is used on style steel wheels, and these are getting very hard to come by. This is a plastic Nissan Rogue hubcap for a 16 inch steel wheel. Here are some more racks that I constructed myself. If any of you guys ever want to build racks like I did, you can go and get all your supplies at the Home Depot. Be sure to measure your needs ahead of time and you can have them cut. You can have the wood cut to your specifications. Here you can see these are more old hubcaps. I really like the old-fashioned metal hubcaps because back then cars really had style. These here are dog dish hubcaps similar to the ones I showed you earlier in the video. More dog dish hubcaps. Here's an example of some hubcaps that do stack fairly well. These are all brand new hubcaps in the package that I buy direct from the dealership. Keep in mind these are all factory original hubcaps not that cheap China crap that you see all over Amazon. There's a very rare Rambler hubcap. Some more various hubcaps that are just stacked up. There's some neat Cougar 14 inch wire spokes. Some random hubcaps. This is from a 1970 Cadillac DeVille or Fleetwood. These are some more Ford center hubcaps mostly for Ford trucks. These are some random GM center hubcaps for alloy wheels and we end up right back where we started at my store. Guys, thanks for watching. If you have any specific needs or requests, hit me up. Thanks for watching once again. I'm Crazy New York Driver. You're not. I will see you Friday night with my regular eBay video, and I will also be putting out a video about my license plate collection and maybe my Hestoy truck collection as well. Rock on, guys.